to whiskey.com where fine spirits meet. And today I have an American whiskey on my cask and it's a single malt. Yeah, it's the Westward American single malt whiskey. The true Northwest. Yeah, this whiskey is from Portland, Oregon. Or is it really Portland or is it just Oregon? I think from around Portland. Yeah, the distillery I think is in Portland, but yeah, Portland doesn't grow in their own barley. So the the region of Portland, and uh, not of Portland, of Oregon is known for their barley. And that's where, where they get their barley from to make the West Ward single cask. I think I've already had some of the whiskey uh, on my cask here and I've talked a bit about that. So if you want more background information about them, then you should watch that video. Although I don't have um, tons of background information because um, I have not been to Portland or this distillery yet. But this year is now an exclusive for whiskey.de. So this is our own bottling. You will not find that out on the market. And yeah, let's have a look how this bottling is. Hmm, looks like the, the bottle is not filled to the very top. That means this bottle is probably one of the bigger bottles and that they are filling by uh, what do you call it? They're filling by volume and not by height. Oh, the cork. That's a bit of a. It it looks it looks airtight, but it's not the best cork. Mm. Oh, that smells like a. a a huge amount of scotch but with a with a very strong cask influence like you would feel a first filled bourbon cask but even stronger mm. no feels nice there's a lot of vanilla a lot of caramel but also a lot of maltiness to it or a lot of i feel like cereals it smells like a bit of a when you when you fill that these cereals into your breakfast bowl and you haven't added the milk yet some people will not relate as they fill the milk first but never mind no I like it it has really a, a great deal of cereal touch to it if if you'd give me that in the blind tasting I would probably say oh it's one of these American full grain whiskies where they mix different grains but it's a hundred percent barley. Mm. Oh, very, very mild and very, very round and mm, a bit of a buttery touch to it. A lot of cereal as well. Mm, and a lot of oak influence, a lot of American oak influence and vanilla caramel it's not that typical southern style bourbon popcorn going on but a lot of vanilla and caramel in there mm. 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 Wahnsinn. yeah sorry my chairman it's just incredible mm. Mm. it's it's really strange because it at the beginning it feels like a single malt and then there comes that american fresh american oak through where you think oh is, is that a bourbon mm. and then it just it's not as sweet as a bourbon it does have a lot of sweetness but it's not as sweet as a bourbon and i like it mm -hmm. it's nice so yeah that was the westward single cask so you can get single cask from this distillery you just have to yeah, have enough uh people to get uh enough bottles from that and you can probably get that uh if you get all the the orders together to get whole cask you can get that probably from a store if you're in the us or if you have in the in germany then you have to have good connections like we do yeah so yeah, that was it. Thank you very much for watching and see you next time.